Hello everyone, my name is Raven and welcome to Raven67854 Gaming and welcome back to another Left 4 Dead 2 SDK tutorial. And in this tutorial what we're going to do is over here, oops, we are going to build a large area and put a skybox. So that's as the title of this tutorial says, skybox, we're just going to build our quote unquote outdoor area. So the next, or obviously the, the thing we need to do most is, and I don't even know why I'm doing this. Scrolling, trying to find the dev textures with thousands and thousands and thousands of textures. Yeah, that'll work out well. Uh, anyway, so we're just we're just gonna go on ahead and uh, get our nice orange dev texture here, and we are gonna drag it down so that it matches the same height as our little platform that we have there. And we're gonna make this room like really big, like this. This is puny small. Like, come on, we want. A really, really big room. So. There we go. See that? That is a room. This is a room. There we go. Look at that room. Oh, yeah. Oops. All right. Because, you know, we want a lot of room. Because, you know, we're going to have some terrain in here. We're going to have some other stuff. So, you know, we want some, we want some decent room in this place. Okay. Make sure everything's right here. All right. Everything looks good. And we're just going to hit enter. Awesome. And now we're going to switch to our dev texture ray, which is our walls, as it has been. And one thing I want to point out about these walls here, um, they need to be really, really tall. Also, that actually does need to go back. Uh, let's uh, Let's zoom in here a little bit. Okay. Well, they don't have to be tall, uh, but I want them to be tall. All right. And I could take that down just to match it up. It really doesn't matter. Um, way more than 224. Uh, let's do 512. Yeah, let's do 512. Where's 512? Awesome. How tall is that? Oh, that is. Woo. Wow. That is really tall. Enter. Okay. And now just, you know, you know the drill. Just go on ahead and just fill it in make sure you select your uh your new wall brush so you get your height properly and i'm just gonna go all the way over here and we're just gonna go all the way over here of course we're gonna cut a hole uh for a door you know as soon as we're uh as soon as we need it all right and da -da -da -da. Okay. And now we're just going to drag this over here and we're done. We're just going to make our uh there we go. So now everything is, you know, a little a little better. Uh go on ahead and select the uh dev texture there or the texture face the face edit sheet or the texture tool. Uh and just go ahead and apply that just so we have some consistency. Okay, so now we have our utterly massive Massive, massive, massive room. So now we need obviously a door because you know what's the point in you know having a having a room? And we're gonna make this a fairly large door. Like I want some room in here. Um, and I'm just gonna drag this down because you know I don't I don't want it to take up the whole bit of the. Make sure it's level. Um. So 192 is the full height. Uh, I think I'm going to do 160. Place it, and then carve it, and then delete it. It's pretty, you know, that, that should be fine. Um, let's go ahead and fix the, uh, the floor really fast. Okay, awesome. All right, so we have our little area. They come out, they walk up. And we're probably going to add, like, another way in here, you know, have some additional stuff. And maybe in a way later advanced tutorial, uh, we'll look at... Uh, you know, director AI, so, like, we can block off areas, so, you know, depending on where they spawn is which direction they end up going to. Um, okay, so now we need a skybox. So make sure with your brush tool selected, open up the textures, and just type in skybox. And specifically, we're looking for this, tools skybox, because we actually set our skybox um, in map properties. And I'm going to go ahead and select the floor there. 
And I'm just going to drag this all the way across. This is a humongous, humongous brush. Um, yeah, I'm just going to take this all the way up. And then hit enter. Boom. We have our skybox. So, tools, options. Um, Uh, you know, let's just go ahead and run this, uh, and just go ahead and run map, and we'll just take a look at what this looks like. Uh, obviously, of course, we need light out there, um, but we're going to cover the directional light next time. And we're also, in the next tour, I'm going to show you how to quickly change the skybox. it got to wait for it to load. Come on. Demo. Grab a weapon. What weapon do we have here? Oh. Nope. Crowbar. Always the crowbar. And of course, another thing I need to show everyone is how to uh, how how to uh, fix the light map scaling, so you can get you know blurrier shadows or blockier shadows or whatever look you're going for. And as you can see now, we have a beautiful default skybox, which is what we're going to leave it to. But we don't have any light. So in the next video, what we're going to do is we're going to change our skybox texture. If you want to, you don't have to. It's perfectly fine. I mean, after all, that is a perfectly acceptable skybox there. Uh, and we're going to add light to this area. A nice, lovely directional light. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you have any questions, just post it down below. And if you'd like to support this channel, there's a Patreon link in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next one.